And we're back at you with the Mad Channel. Yes, here we go. We're live on the scene after day night with our review of the place. Yo, that voice is hilarious. <laughs> That's like the news anchor voice. That's what I was trying to do. Like, because we had did a countdown before we clicked it. I was like, five, four, three, two, one. Hey, what's up, Mad Family? What's good, y'all? Comments, y'all, with another video. Ooh, not for nothing though. Hold on, before I start, look at the skin. Are you liking the glow right now? I'm liking the glow. The glow is nice. You do look beautiful. Oh, thank you, baby. Yes, ma'am. I'm liking the glow, and you look handsome. Thank you very much. No problem. So, don't judge us. We're running late. Per usual, um, it is our anniversary. So this is the beginning of it's our anniversary. Our that we have when we started dating is May 16th, 2013 and we got married May 16th, 2017. So, just a fun fact about us, we only have one anniversary day. Keep it easy, keep it simple. Only gotta remember one day. One day. One. Man, see everything I've been trying to do to help this man out. Woof. Lord Jesus. One day. <laughs> Our anniversary. <laughs> Tell me why you really said it like that. Like you, you made it easier for me. I did. Like, <laughs> I tried to make it easy. Nah, it's not even about that. Honestly speaking, I mean, that was just something else I thought about. But honestly speaking, I wanted to do that. I just thought that was so dope to be able to get married on the same day that y'all started dating. You know, I just like that fact. So we did that. I am surprising Michael. He doesn't know where we're going somewhere we're about 20 minutes away and this is just the beginning so our our actual anniversary is may 16th it is currently may 15th and we're just starting it today because tomorrow's monday and obviously you know you can't do too much on a monday especially when you have kids and a child that is in school so we're just starting our celebration early and i'm surprising him with our first anniversary gift i think he's gonna love it um what do you think it is keep saying we're gonna get dirty so it's either something with paint or uh, mud or bubbles or I don't forget the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> and I say bubbles because of that museum that we went to last time that had the bubbles. Yeah, yeah. You never know with me. <laughs> I'm a mystery. Hey, that's bars. Yo, we sitting here dying because he just realized he had a hole in his shirt. You could barely see. But I don't know, go babe. I don't know if y'all can see, he got paint on his shorts, right? So when we leaving the house, I'm like, yo, like, what's up? He's like, well, you said we're gonna get dirty. And I'm like, okay, the shorts is cool, but just bring an extra set of shorts because, you know, we're gonna go to dinner after. And he brought like a different shirt, thank God. So he brought extra clothes. But it was funny because I'm like, yo, you took it to the extreme. Like, you came out. I said, go comfortable. She said, wear clothes that you don't care about. Yeah, I did. I care about all my clothes, so I'm going to wear the worst ones. Yeah, which was a shirt with a hole and some shorts with some paint. That is hilarious. I try to make my clothes last, you know what I mean? Facts. Big I facts. Seen, I seen this commercial the other day that said, basically, buy better stuff and wear it longer. That way you're buying less and you're wasting less. So that's the reason why I'm like, I like that. So I, we're here, we're walking to there, we just parked. But I found this place on TikTok and their original place or location, I guess they have several locations, was in Sugarland, but I guess that one wasn't open yet. So it ended up, I ended up changing it to this part of town, which I think is city center. And it ends up working out because this is the place I wanted to go to, to begin with. Because it has all these shopping centers and stuff around here. 
You excited, baby? Yes, I am. It's pretty dope. Yeah. She always coming up with something mad different. Mm -hmm. So this is what I picked. Baby, what did you pick? The candle holder. And we're doing these two together. Looking good so far. <laughs> it's quite dirty, so I don't know how much I'm going to be able to walk, but I'm going to try to get in there a little bit. What? You want what? You want what? what? Prime seafood, prime steak. I don't even eat seafood. Prime steak. Only seafood I eat is the food that I see. And me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was looking at. <laughs> Grimaldi's whole brick oven pizza. It smells so good in here. It does. It oh, does. Really good. It smells amazing. So how was it? It was a lot of fun, honestly. I didn't expect it at all. I thought it was gonna be something with paint. You are close. Yeah, it was close. Yeah, he's gonna get painted. <laughs> that was fun. I wish we could have filmed more, but it was messy. Yeah. Very messy. And then, honestly, I'm gonna be real. I was more frustrated at the girl because I felt like we was on the right track the first time. And she time messed it up. And messed it up completely. Yes. I was like, bro, like, do you even know what you're doing? Uh, bruh. And I could tell it pissed you off. Bruh. That's why I was mad. <laughs> Yo, cause I'm like, I was like, bro, did you really just destroy the whole thing? Like, like shit. I think she didn't mean to do that, and then she tried to. She saw like how we was looking. And we like, listen, we just took our whole spirit. <laughs> mm, messed it all up. We was doing good. Like we had it. I think the first time around, and like he said, she low-key messed it up, and I was like, over it. <laughs> So this is what's left of Pixie's your salad. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it was good though. We went in literally like, I was like, wait, we need to show what we got. Right, so here goes a little clip. Yeah. With her, uh, what is that, Dr. Pepper? Mm -hmm. Look how good this brick oven pizza looks. Mm. Good? It's so worth it. Ah, he gonna be hurting. How's it tasting, Mama? Oh, really good. Ooh. Yeah, I caught you. It's really good. Oh yeah. Well, they eat at least one more. Yeah. Pizza was a smash hit. What? We got a so good pizza good. spot. So good. Love it. So happy. We only ate half a part. Taking the other half home to my mother-in-law and my babies. Yeah, so they can enjoy this good pizza. I know Myla's going to be disappointed. doesn't have a lot of pepperonis, but it's still good. And we're back at you <laughs> with the Mad Channel. Yes, here we go. We're live on the scene after day night with our review of the place. Yo, that voice is hilarious. <laughs> That's like the news anchor voice. That's what I was trying to do. Like, cause we had did a countdown before we clicked it. I was like, five, four, three, two, one. So uh, I think it was a success. What did you think, honey? It was a lot of fun. Once again, she she be picking them, man. I don't know what it is. She, she know what, what she's doing, you know what I mean? Honestly, what it is for me is like, I want to try new experiences so i knew i've never done that i thought my husband has never done that this would be something to be able to put in the books of but, like what but then she found out i remembered everything from art class in high school and i was actually nice at this you know what i mean yo I was, I was guiding he thought he was the master he was like no do this he kept telling me i'm like boy you don't even know what you're doing like, she, That's listen what she, she was mad shy and timid like she thought they were gonna walk us through step by step. Yeah, they were. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, we could go on to the next thing. She's like, I wasn't no. sure. Cause she said we were doing it three steps. So I'm like, she didn't even show us how to shape it, like for the thing. But overall, it still was a great experience. It was I would fun. definitely do it again. It was very nice, intimate. If your drink, you know, over 21, you were allowed to bring your own drinks. Yep. The couple next to us was filling themselves. They had a couple beers. Yeah, they was <laughs> chilling. So it was really really a great a experience time. i picked this date night let's see it was it's not even a date night because it's not a date night it's our anniversary date it's a, oh, okay. I already let's see what my husband has planned you guys 
this is just the beginning. We'll see you guys. Yeah. Baby brought me for some dessert. We got some Baskin Robbins ice cream to end the night. Yeah, definitely. I went all in with the dairy today. The pizza, the ice cream. He's going to have an eventful night. Yeah, got to get all on one system before the morning. <laughs> <laughs>